Hello everyone and welcome to FTB Unleashed with me, Joe and Weber. Yes! How you doing guys? Welcome back everyone! Oh my god, we have a lot of coal. Yes. I managed to kill some blazes, got some blaze rods here, uh, some blaze powder and some ender tanks because we're going to go to the nether. But first of all, I'm going to also need an ender thermic pump and for that we're going to need a uh, lava bucket, water bucket, iron pick and a load of other gobbly goose. How did we get so much coal? Uh, I went mining for ages. Basically, did you? I did. I've got a fortune pick because I fell in lava in the Nether. Gas blew me off that cobblestone bridge I made, and uh, it was lagging out horribly. So, uh, sorry. Well, not lagging out. I just kind of so fell you off. died. Yeah, and I died. So I had to make some new Alamax. Came back to life. But I made the shovel of hope three, and the Alamax and the slime bow five thousand, which you may have noticed is a little bit high, more high def than the last time. My uh, my bow because I actually made some custom textures for it, Weber. That's very cheeky. So Weber, what what do you want to do today then? We're gonna go to the Nether, get some lava, and then I think we, you want to go and get that oil, don't you? Yeah, I'm I'm gonna go get the oil. Uh, so you and Joe are gonna go find that thingy, and I'm gonna make all these transfer pipes. Okay. But the thing is, I don't know where the oil is actually marked on the map. Oh right. Um, the oil is I'll tell you the coordinates, um, and you can then pr first of all press them. Um, Press minus. Hold on, let me just do this. Okay, tell me when you want to know the coordinates and I'll show you. Um, so yeah, I need okay. to make an endothermic pump. Yeah, sorry, you got it? Yeah, um, minus. Yep. Oop. Then, uh... It's lagging out horribly. Are you in just minus? Just pop that redstone in, in, the, th in the thing. Tommy, have you got any regular crafting Joe. tables? Because I can't use it while you are. Pass, pop the uh, make a minium in. stone, Joe. Uh, put the just make a minium stone. There we go. Okay, tell me. Make a minium stone. I'm ready. Why? Because uh, a minium stone that is acts like a crafting table. So you can press C and you can use it. What are you holding no. there? What was that? This. Yeah. Ender tank. That's what we're gonna use. Oh God. To get the lava. It's gonna be it's amazing. Cool. Okay. Um, I got I got a stack and a half of these. All right. That should probably not be enough, but it's a good okay. start. I'll, there's I'll also more, but... there's also more in here. Where are the coordinates? So the coordinates, if you press minus, I'll, and you can put them in, in X, Y, okay. and, in X, Z, and Y. Um, okay. So X is minus 641. 641. Z is 283. Yeah. And the Y is 63. It's not letting me get this iron chest plate out, actually. Oh, what is it? Where's it going? I got, it, I got it for you. I wonder what that is. Can I have oh, it? I just sense. give it to you. Do you want me to use okay. these wires all the way? Um, yeah, pretty much. Back here. Yeah. And you can put Ooh, and, okay. and and all the way downstairs into and make some oil tanks. So yeah, Joe, do you want to go to the Nether then? Um, yeah, sure. Okay. Let's go. Okay. Bye, so. Joe. Bye, little knob. Wow. <laughs> Good job. Buddy. Weber. Are you just slacks it? Are you? Are you seriously? I need to know. Are you seriously? No, no, no so I, I want to know. Are you dyslexic? I want to know if you are first. Really? Because it does trouble me. I'm getting horrible lag. Like. Are you? I can't like take it. stuff out the crafting table. Like whenever I click on it, it just doesn't leave. I'm gonna go get some lava. Oh, you're just gonna re wow. relog. Wow, a doodle. It might be a glitch or a bit of a bug. Yeah, a bit of a glitch, bit of a bug. Either way, it's not gonna work. Okay, so Joe, if you go way, if you I'll, go through the uh, nether portal and wait for me there, I'm just gonna make this. Okay, is it down? Um, just down here. No, it isn't. It's oh, it's, oh, you know where it's actually. It doesn't matter. There we go. Ender eye and iron pick. <laughs> Ah, uh, um, stone of the reds, and let's make some wire. This is really good wire, and it's really easy to make. I know it is very useful. Um, you've gone the wrong way. I'll show you how to get up. Here. Can it pretty much do anything, Tommy? Yeah, it can carry electricity or Actually, liquids I know or. I know where it goes. It doesn't matter. So yeah. yeah, I think I think that um 
that arcane work tables a bit. Okay. Because the what? crafting tables seem to be doing fine. Oh, I'll swap it back with a normal crafting table then. It's a tad buggy. So how come you've a uh, bit like made a little gap here? Do you need to fill this up or something? Or fill, fill what up? You've this little gap here. What gap? Right here, Tommy, look. Tommy, where Tommy, where the, um, the where the portal is to the rest of the rooms. Whereabouts is the um, pump? And uh, it's in this chest here. There's okay. a steam engine in there. But I wouldn't use steam engine. I use redstone engines. Okay, I'm here in the Nether. Do we have any? Yeah, make some redstone engines. We don't have any. Cool. Okay, you're in the Nether. Okay. Yes, I'm in the Nether. And on this text of the uh, Nether. Uh, yeah, Joe's using the Summerfields pack. Summerfields pack. It's it's to do. Uh, I'm I'm supposed to have facts facts at the moment, but we're having a bit of trouble. Facts. I said facts. Uh, you said facts first. I know. I said facts first. Have facts. It's facts. It's quite it's facts. It's quite hard to say. It's facts. It's facts. Facts. I said facts. <laughs> okay, so I'm actually going to need to make some uh, redstone engines. So guys, I will be right back once I've got these redstone engines. Right, right. so I'm going to make these redstone engines now, Joe. You ready to go to the Nether? Uh, yes, I'm definitely ready. Are you I can't just wait. Sorry, you're not, just... Joe. You're not ready because you're just kidding about, really, aren't you? Is he? Do yeah. you think? Do you think that's what's he's happening? He's pretty much just mucking about. He doesn't know what he's saying. Whoa. That's a bit hard. Stop fucking about. Oi! You know what? I'm gonna actually slaughter you now. I'm gonna kick your ass. Whoa. Come here. Come here. Why is it lagging so much? Why in the face? Okay, right. So, Joe, ready to go to another? Yeah, I'm ready. Okay. Oh, it's because I'm downloading Photoshop, I think. Right, so I need to make some quick... Joe can't work. find me, so it's quite funny. I'm gonna find you, and I will kill you. Right, you. Okay, guys, I'm just gonna wait until oh, this... You are. I'm gonna wait until this lag spike comes ah! down, and I'll be right back. Right, guys, so I'm gonna go to the nether now, and we are going to find a good place to put down this uh, lovely tank thing. It's basically like a pump, but uh, instead... It's basically got um, some good stuff about it. Basically, it's a pump... Um, but instead of leaving, um... Whoa, there's a, uh, ghast in a kind of hat over here. Cool. It's pretty awesome. Um, I think I got it as well, so... Um, I'm going up to the nether because I want to try and find a good place... Um, to... Hang on, I need to get some blocks. To find... Uh, a good place, and I know there's a massive lava lake below me, so I'm gonna go down there. I'm gonna get a pump, basically, but it's a special type of pump which replaces all the lava with um, stone blocks, so it stops the server from lagging because um, it lags quite a lot when lava's flowing everywhere, so it's pretty pretty good there. Um, so it basically stops the lava from flowing everywhere, just replaces the lava with a piece of stone. And Weber, of course, is going off to get his oil, so that's another good thing. Yeah. You got lots of oil stuff going on. I got lots. Lots of lovely oil goodness flowing through the world. Because we yes. found three big oil wells at coordinates like minus 600, something like that. Yeah. Well, that squeaky chair is in the background there. Away. A squeaky chair, I can hear. Squeakers. It's squeaking, I see. Squeakington's chairs. Oh, there's a red creeper the over best. there. The best. Only the best chair. I'm gonna take this red creeper down. I'm down. It's seen me. Has like half the fuse of a normal creeper. Pretty, uh, pretty intense stuff. So yeah, I like to bring coal stone so I can patch up all these stupid holes that the gas makes. Cause it's like a one block, a netherrack block thick thing, which is pretty bad. <laughs> so just patch up these holes. Oh, what the hell was that? There's a magma cube that just fell down there. Well guys, had a little bit of a crash there, don't know what happened, uh, just my Minecraft just closed down, no crash report, no nothing, just, just crashed. It's terrible. Oh, I get that, I get that. Do you? Did the, did the whole launcher close down? Just the whole thing just collapsed, just died. Yeah, I get that in a hex, it like every time I play, at least every ten minutes, and it's the most annoying thing. Does it? Oh dear. Yep. Poor weather. I'm back to and the it's side. It's so hard to edit. I'm back to the site where we had the, um, the big... Oh, I think I found a way down, Weber. To the surface, and I just got set on fire. There's a gas floating around somewhere, but I've got my bow. 
Got my handy dandy bow, however. I'm gonna kill some stuff. So where are you right now then, Webs? Building a oil thing. Oh yeah, getting across. It. How are you doing with that oil thing? Well, I'm still making the pathway to get there. Oh yeah. I know what you mean. It's taking a while. Right. Okay, so I've got to be a little bit careful here. Make a path round. See if I can get reasonably far around anyway. <laughs> it's going to be very dangerous, but I'm making a path all the way around this lava lake. It's going to be. Oh yeah. It's extremely frisky. I'm only 109 meters from the oil now. Is it in the middle of the ocean? Um. Yeah, pretty much. Oh, that's not good. It's fine though. Is it on an oil platform? Is it? Is it actually? Is it on the water? Is it on sand or? It's like on the water. Oh, for God's sake! <laughs> Why? What? What's wrong with that? That couldn't have been worse. It is a little bit annoying, but it's the best we got. It's really annoying. Not a little bit annoying. It's absolutely annoying. Right, so I'm going to put down my endothermic pump there. And then put the. Oh shoot! The gas. There's a gas somewhere. Can't see him though. As I said, guys, got to be careful here. He's over there. Shoot him blind. Okay, I've got to be careful. Got to take the ender tank. Place it down. Over there. Where is this guy coming from? I can't see him. Just shooting into the blindness, Weber. There's a there's a gas, Weber. He's attacking me. Okay. Uh, it's a tiny platform as well, so I've got to be careful. Well, guys, uh, came back and there's a fire back here. Took him down though. There's a lot of bad stuff. Okay, the gas is in sight, or kind of in sight. Maybe, perhaps, possibly. There he is. He's over there. He's just. He's just tiddling. Can't quite see him though. Okay. He's over, he's just in sight, but he's just, he's just going around the corner, Weber. I can't get to him, Weber. But oh, how, yeah. you, how are you doing with your uh, lovely, your oh. lovely? Because it's in the middle of the water, I'm having to build this like little platform out. Which is really annoying, but it's alright. Why did you go into the, did you take a boat out here? Yeah, I did. Oh my god, I can see them. They're like, they're like one humongous one. And then there's another two small one, ones. Another one, and another one. Bites the dust. <laughs> yeah, pretty much. I'm loving the uh, speed of my pick, actually. It's beautiful. Okay, right, so. Let's build a little bit of protection for my, uh. My engines, my redstone engines. Actually, I didn't build a wrench. I'm going to have to do this the hard way. Okay, I'm going to pick all these uh, things up then. And take the ender tank back. I've got to be careful though with this ender tank. It's very valuable. <laughs> okay, that wasn't what I meant to do. Okay, get the ender tank. Well, there's a lot of uh, horrible monsters around. Got to be careful. Is there? Uh... Can you hear any of them? No. Oh, they're quite loud and annoying. Oh, I hear yeah, a bit of span clicking going on. Yeah. Okay, I think. I... Oh, Jesus Christ.
No. He's taking down all my. He just took out one of my engines. No, come on now. He's got a piston held on. Really? Who does? No! It's gassed. There we go, took him down. I took it to the man, whatever. Well done. Okay, let's just get this flipping lever down and get the hell out of here. Okay, right, run. Do do do. But we've definitely got we're definitely getting lava though, which is good. Okay, run, 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 run. Okay. Okay, geez, that was uh, that was a close one, whatever. But uh, it worked out in the end. What was that? It worked out in the end. But I can still hear gas about, so I've got to be still on my feet. Yep. Geez, there's gas attacking. I've got a bow this time. Attacking. Okay, took him down. To oh, I got gassed here as well. Jeez. Thank you very much. Thank you very much, Mr. Gassed. This this nether spawn is like the most dangerous one I've ever think I've ever had. There's really? just so many places to fall off and just die. I know it was such a bad spawn. It wasn't even actually on the Nether Island. No, it was just on a random. If we made it, if we one. made another portal, would we be, would we go somewhere else? No, we just go back to the same one. We just, it's just a one thick. It's just a one block thick Nether. What if, what if we did a Miss Book? If we did a Miss Book, we, it would work. But I'm not really sure how the new Miscraft works, so I'm gonna have to check that up. Yeah. But in the meantime, Weber, I've got an Ender Tank. So I'm going to go over here and place it down and see if any lava comes out of it. So hopefully it does. Put it here. Okay, so it's all full. And then we just twist it round like that. Yes, yeah, there we go, we got lava. Got lava coming from the nether now for our smeltery. Awesome. That's pretty good, isn't it? It's pretty good. It's quite the tiddler. It is. Now, I don't know if this chunk loads on its own. So I'm going to wait and see if this if this fills up all the way, then it means it is chunk loading, which is good. If it doesn't, then I'm going to actually have to make the perilous journey back and put a chunk loader down. That would be good, though. So, Weber, how I'm going to come over now and see how your oil's getting on. How is your oil getting on? It's going well. It's going well. Is it going really well? You're going to have to run down the tunnel that takes like 20 minutes to get here. Is it a huge tunnel underground? <laughs> yeah. Oh, because of the... Uh... If you go down into the oil room, you'll see it. The oil room. The oil room. Okay, so I'll put away these redstone engines and levers and all this guff. And take a couple more arrows, and I'll be right down with you, Ever. Okay. I'm coming down to see how it's going along. So is it going really well? It's going pretty well. So hopefully you guys are enjoying the FTV only so far. I I certainly am. Yeah. It's been uh, pretty good. Next episode, um, by the way, we're going to uh, you know get a that smeltery. Uh, I haven't actually showed you this yet. The smeltery is all being put away over here. Um, I didn't actually explain. The smeltery's been moved between episodes uh, because we wanted to move it from outside into this new smeltery chambers room. And uh, so we put smelteries down, this one's got a few more things, it's basically exactly the same as the one outside, and then downstairs we've got the one that we're going to automate, which is this one. I found a way in my test world to automate them, so that's going to be pretty cool. Tis. Tis going to be quite awesome. So I'm going to get round... It's quite the underground there. It is. So I'm going to get down to... Oh jeez. So I'm in the oil tunnel, where does it go? Oh, this way. Oh my god, okay guys, I'm going to go this way, find weather, and I'll be right back. Well guys, Weber wasn't kidding when he said that this is a long tunnel. It's taken quite a while to get here, but I'm finally at this ladder. So Weber, how you doing with the uh, with the pump then? I can see you at that oil well. And you're building a big cobblestone path across. Yeah. I'm you just know. about to place it down. Okay, so this is the one of them. And 
just so you can sh we can show you what we mean by a uh, big oil well is if we head under here we can see I'm just gonna take a little bit of a breath and swim down we can see that if we go down here there is a huge oil lake down there and I'm not gonna go too far because otherwise I'm probably gonna die but basically down there is a huge oil lake and we're gonna get so much power from this it's gonna be ridiculous so I don't think so are you sure do you think we've actually got enough of this wiring I don't know, we might do. Have you got the engine, the redstone engine. So I go and get the redstone engines. I've got steam engine on me. Oh, we don't need to, we don't want steam engines, we want redstone engines. I'll yeah, go. we do. So I'll go back. Steam's good, it'll do it quicker. Yeah, no, but we can't leave a steam running. Um, we have to Why? leave redstone. Because it will explode. Oh. Uh, so I'll go and get the steam and be right back. Uh, go and get the redstone. Need redstone. The redstone. Yeah, and I'll be right back. Alright guys, so I'm up here, and it's going to be awesome. I'm going to put down my levers, redstone engines, yeah, and the pump's going to start going. So, we actually need to get a, um, we actually need to get, have you got that liquid thing? The liquid thingy thing. I need to go back and get that. What liquid thingy? You need a liquid, um, like, well, I don't know what it's called, node or something, to, like, say that it's liquid that you're using. Okay. So I need to get that. Let's go. I'm gonna jump back. Is it actually possible for us to walk down what? here now? Yeah. It won't be eventually. Do you want me to keep building the cable back? Don't build the cable back just yet. I need to go back and get some uh, some things. Okay. I need to get the. Uh, I need to get the. First of all, I need to get the um, node, and I need to also. Actually, that's it, pretty much. Just the node. I'll get a few boats for us so we can get head back quicker. Okay. Well, I'm going to have to go down the tunnel and place down the wire anyway. So. Alright. Okay. Right, so I've got the liquid node for weather, and I'm going to run back down now. Okay. Actually, I'm going to take the boat cause it's a lot quicker. going to make myself a boat. Get a boat. Get a boat. Get a boat, get a boat, get a boat, get Where a is boat. The boat. What? I'm getting a boat, Wubba. It's gonna be amazing. I know. I'm waiting. I'm looking into the sea, waiting. Waiting for me to come. For, uh, for you. To arrive. I'm, I'm off sailing, Wubba. I'm off. I'm off to sail at night. Here Hi. we go. Do 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 do. Into. Into the stars. Alright guys, I've arrived at the oil... Platform. Oil platform, it's amazing. And I'm gonna... D I, so you're placing down all the wires. How far are you back now, at the moment? Um, I'm actually pretty close, probably about... I just need a couple more stacks, because I just ran out. All right. Probably about two more stacks, and then I should be good. So there's gonna be a little bit of oil that pokes through the... Maybe a little bit of water that somehow gets through, but I doubt that's actually gonna happen. Right, it's okay, because I set up another tank as well. So we'll go into the other tank. Alright. Well, that's good then, isn't it? It is. Okay, right, I'm gonna... Probably not a good idea to go th down this way. I'm gonna... Go back dr um, via my boat to other and uh, meet you on the other side, effectively. Okay. So we'll have a race. You probably... You don't have enough, though, do you? Enough what? Um, of that cable to do all of it. I do now. Do you? I just made a crap ton. Did you? Oh, we're gonna need a lot anyway. I made three stacks and a half, which is quite a lot. So do we want to be pumping from all three of those oil wells at once, or do we want to just do one at a time and move it across? Do one at a time. Do one at a time for now. Okay. Well, we can, we've set this one up this episode, but I could, I could probably go around and connect them all. Between episodes? Uh, between. Because next episode I want to automate that smeltery because that would be quite a fun thing to do. So we don't have to use the macerator and stuff. It's actually pretty yeah. easy because it's like a macerator and a furnace in one. So it's it's uh, it's really good actually. Okay. And we'll, set, we'll set up the quarry as well because we've got enough for a quarry. But one, once we smelt the ores in there, can we only use them for tinkers? Uh, no, no, we can use it for anything. So what, they make ingots? Yeah, yeah. They do? Yep. Where do the ingots get put? 
Do they just pop out? Or well, basically, you, you, I'm going to melt them all up in the furnace, in the in the smeltery, and I'm going to pump out the ingots. I'm going to automatically make because you can make the cast like um, port get poured out with the redstone signal. So I'm going to pour it out into yeah. an ingot cast. I've got like ten ingot casts, and then pump it out with a redstone engine. Okay. So pretty simple, really, but it's going to be good. It's going to be amazing. So I'm gonna come see how far you are. Can't see your character on the screen yet, so. Okay. Oh, I can see you coming now. I can see you in the distance. So yeah, Fair another thing stars. we have, another thing that's quite hard to notice really at this point, um, is that you've noticed that like you can put two torches in one block now, and stuff. Oh yeah. That's actually a new mod called Forge Multipart, which is pretty cool. So that's a pretty cool mod. So you can like put. Torches in the same. Oh, sorry about that. Oh, but like torches in the same corner and stuff like that. So, how close are we now, Tommy? We're getting very close. It's not too far away now. How much have you got left? A stack and thirty-seven. A stack and thirty-seven. It's gonna be close. It's gonna be close. I bet. I bet we'll be about six or five or three or two or one off. I bet you. Do you think? Yeah. I'm just gonna take these ores while I'm here. Okay. Oh. There's a bit of uranium back here as well. Yeah, we're, we're getting very close now. Okay, how far? How far? <laughs> oh no, we've done it, we've done it. Oh, that does. There we are. Dune, Dune. There we go. Now, weather. The one thing we're gonna have to do now is we're gonna have to get some chunk loaders <laughs> and chunk load this thing. We're gonna have to what? Chunk load. Chunk load. Yeah, all of the pipes. Okay, so it's not gonna come through unless we chunk load it. Okay, so you're gonna do that now. Yeah. Well, we'll do that between episodes because I think we're coming up to the end of the episode now. So, okay. Thank you for watching, guys. This epic adventure of oil. And we should uh, we should be getting some oil in the um, automated oil room soon. It's gonna be amazing. Or the oil refinery and power plant. So yeah, we'll thank... extend the power plant out. Yeah. I think I'll extend it out a bit more for you. Mhm. Mm that be good. So yeah, thank you for watching. Next episode, as I said, we're gonna get this uh, smeltery automated. Uh, so thank you for watching, and we will see you next time. Goodbye. Goodbye. Thank you.